Hi there. Greetings to you all. So excited to be here today. What a beautiful, beautiful day. Greetings, everyone. We are the Pleiadians. Here is one of our representatives wanted to speak with you. Hi all, my name is Ayana. I am part of the Pleiadian Council and I am the higher self of this vehicle. Here, I encourage her to keep in touch with you, Joanne. I am the one who has encouraged her to send our message. Earlier today, she was seeing, she was watching actually, a video from you and we wanted her to know about the changes that will happen in the near future in this part of the world. She is currently living in Italy. It is purposeful. They needed the occupants of this country <sighs> needed a lot of light workers that could sustain the energies that are being currently released here. She is one of them. She knows now. She really fully knows about the powerful being that she is. She is ready to help and to support everyone in this part of the world. There is a massive energy coming towards Earth, coming towards, not towards, but from, coming from the planet, coming from the core of Gaia. She is almost at the point of releasing her soul, her core. So <sighs> here, like We've told her before in this part of the world, they will experience a big eruption from Edna, a volcano situated 
in the island of Sicily shortly after or almost simultaneously a big earthquake, what you can call here like almost eight degrees Fahrenheit will take place. The same, the same time, other parts of the world will experience another disasters like tsunamis and a lot of rain, a lot of floods and the solar flare and the the vehicle wants to say what you are calling here the laser laser event so yes that will be going on soon it will be sooner than you all expecting so this message is for you all those who are here to listen it be prepared be ready please please get out get out of your shells let the light go through you are needed now more than ever you have to stay strong become the sovereign beings you were supposed to become for all those who choose to be here in sustaining this planet, in sustaining their creation, in sustaining human, be ready. You are needed now more than ever. Hold the light, hold the light. Please support all of them. You are here for that. And for all those that knows in their hearts that have to do it, please listen to this call. Get up, stand up and hold the light. Give them love and support. Help them. Because you know those who I am talking now, you all know why you are here. It is for this divine purpose. We need you. We need you as you need us. We are one. All of those who choose to be in service of humanity during these times, please stand up. You can't hide anymore. Take your role. We are here. We are helping you. We are giving you so much energy we are sending you so much love and our light please receive it receive it and give it forward you are here for that you have to help help them <sighs> this is my message for you all Empower yourselves. 
know that you are not alone. You are light bringers. You are light holders. You are us, part of us on earth doing this divine work. So please, all of you listen. Listen to me, stand up. Stand up, leave the fear. You are not here for that. You are not here to experience anything from that perspective. You are here to bring light. To bring light and to hold light. Because you know that so many are needing it are in need for that now. The time is here. It will begin soon. So be ready. This is what you would say in your earth language. This is the last call, stand up all. Get into your divine position, the one that you wanted to get here, to express here. Please, you have all our love and all our support. Just ask for it. We are here always. Why? Why? Why you are experiencing fear? That was not what was supposed to be for you. Oh, dear ones, dear ones. Please, please, please stand up. Help them, they need you, they need you so much. You, you will know that I am talking to you and you and you. You will feel this, you will know this. This is an urgent wake up call to anyone that lost their path. Please come back to your higher selves. Come back to your purposes. Hold the light. Hold the light and send love to everyone who is in fear and trauma because there will be a lot, a lot of them a lot of them that will experience that. And you being there, holding the light for them, you will help them enormously. You will help them release in order for the shift to take place. That was my message for you today. I am Ayana, and I love you so immensely. I love you, and I'm here always for you, for each and every one of you. Whenever you want to contact me, please do it. I am here always. Oh, how I love you. I love you. I love you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Really appreciated that connection. Is there anyone else that would like to give us a message through the speaker? Yes. 
I am Archangel Michael. I want you all to know that I am there for you, that all of us are. Please know that. Stop the doubt. Stop the fear. We are here. We are helping you and sending you so much light. And for all the light workers, the light holders, we want you to know we are there by your side. We will do this. We got this. It is almost. We are almost there. And know that. Once you will get out of fear. The fear that kept all of us, all of you, so blocked for so many, many years. It is finally to the point that will be vanished. It will disappear. Love has won. Love is always winning because everything you chose to experience all this it was for you to going back into the love into your pure self we want you to know that Gaia is almost there, almost there, and we are with you, we are helping you with holding this energy, this pure divine light that she and all humanity needs for the shift. That is all. I am. I want you to know that All the archangels, or the angels, the light beings, everyone is here with you. You have to release the fear. We are holding your back. You are our feet on earth. You are us. Thank you. Much love and light to you all, brothers and sisters. Thank you so much, Michael. Is there any other messages through this vehicle? It's just her subconscious here. We wanted to say hello, dear mm. Joe, that we love you so much and we are so thankful for everything that you are doing in these great times for humanity and for dear Gaia. <laughs> she is so thankful to you and 
all of them are thankful to you because you were a trigger for so many. You cannot even imagine how many. This vehicle as well. She heard the call. I want to say the Arthurian call, although she is a Pleiadian soul, not just Pleiadian, many, many other particles from many other planets, but she heard the call and you were the messenger, you brought the message for her to listen. So we thank you because you see, thanks to you, she is now in her full awareness. He took her, all her power, powers in. She is now consciously using all the gifts she wants to say gifts although they are not gifts it's just her it's just her soul her essence but now she is fully aware of everything She plays a very important role in this divine, divine play. She is here now in this part of the world to hold the light. There were not many, there are not many here. There were supposed to be, but they get lost and out of track. They lost their true purpose. And we know that you were talking about the ones that were prepared to do the job. And then once they were here on earth, they lose it. They lose the track. They got lost into the materialistic world. So, your true Joanne, this, this fast, fast upgraded, upgrades that were happening to her. It was not in her contract, but she changed it. She wanted, she saw, she felt that many who were supposed to do that, they were not doing it. So she took this role. And we want to tell her that we are so proud of her. We are so proud of her and we can see her light from above. She is truly shining like a star. We know that she has still have some doubt about this greater, this great light, this great bursting light that she has. But we wanted to know that everything she feels, it is true. And she is so very strong and doing a very, very important work here. She has taken a very big mission. She wanted to help and she is helping. She needed to know that although we are telling her every day, every second, I feel like it's a big release to her that we are 
telling this to her while connected with you because she trusts you so much, Joanne. She trusts you and she loves you so much. She can feel your essence. She knows how beautiful and strong and powerful you are. You can say she is even looking at you like a role model. <laughs> a light, light role model, full of light. So we wanted her to know, and you all, of course, that you are prepared for this. You are receiving each and every day and night an enormous amount of energy. So many upgrades for so many people. And that you got it. It is close. The shift will begin very soon. There will be three ways. We have told her about this before, but now, yes, there will be three ways. The first one will be the greeters, the ones that will have to go in advance to prepare everything, to set up the path, the light path for the second and the third wave. She will be one of the first waivers. She has experienced this before. She knows what she will have to do for everyone. She will have to comfort them, to give them love because there will be a lot of, not fear, but like some kind of, the word is not, not, the word is not coming to mind. Anyway, she and others will be the path openers, the door openers for the new earth. <sighs> like we said to her before, and now we are saying again, she will be shifting when the volcano eruption and the earthquake, the big earthquake will start. So this is more like reassuring than a message that she has to trust herself more because she knows in her heart that she is doing an amazing, amazing job. And the role she took, it is very, very important one, but she is handling things very, very good. We are proud of her. We are proud of all of you. We love you so much. We love you. We want you to know that. And we want to know want you to know that you don't have to fear anything. Those who are prepared for that, they have to step up. 
they have to step up and hold the light. This is everything that you need to do. You are meant to choose to do that. So do it. Thank you, Joanne. <laughs> Thank you, subconscious. Are you able to tell us anything about the other time she has done this before? Um, you brought it up and I'm curious to learn more if you don't mind sharing. We are not we are not letting her have this information for this moment. I will. I understand. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, okay. Um, that was amazing messages. Thank you. Is there any other messages that need to be shared? It is all for today. Well, thank you. We I understand. The yes. I feel the vehicle needs to rest. Mm. There's a lot of energy there. She has to. Indeed. Rest. Yes, I appreciate that. Thank you so much for this message today. Uh, we will apply the information and put it into place. And, and we will work diligently on our purpose and service to humanity at this time.